everyone welcome back to my channel we are going to make something very healthy today if you have been following me on my facebook page and instagram then you must have seen that recently i uploaded a dish made out of black chickpeas black chickpeas are also called kala chanas in hindi they look like this so i had extra which i had tucked away in the freezer so we're going to make something out of these these are already boiled and they have a lot of benefits my channel is about healthy food and yummy food so i have to tell you about the benefits black chickpeas are a rich source of plant protein they have vitamins minerals a lot of fiber they give you full for a long time so they are very healthy and today we're going to make something that's called kala chana tikki that is black chickpea tikki out of it so before i tell you the method um if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel please subscribe just now and like and share this video with all your friends so that you can help me grow the community so subscribe to my channel just now so let's have a look at the ingredients this is one bowl of black chickpeas these are boiled i have a healthier version also that i want to uh, share with you these are sprouted black chickpeas but i've kept this for some other time and now we have one onion which is finely chopped i have these bread crumbs these are made out of two slices of brown bread uh, ginger and garlic paste and this coriander leaves chopped this is one green chili chopped this should be according to your the spice that you can tolerate and we have these seasonings that is salt as per your taste a little bit of red chili powder then we have this cumin powder or jeera powder and we have this boiled sweet potato which is also called shakarkandi in raw form it looks like this and we have this oil which is for shallow frying and the first step that we are going to do is grind these black chickpeas which are boiled already in a food processor so pour this uh black chickpea paste into a bowl and one thing very important is that do not add water while grinding otherwise it will be very difficult to make the patties now mash this sweet potato and add it into this mixture one thing i didn't Uh, tell you all was that in case if you don't have the sweet potato, you can use potato also. So now we are going to make uh, add the rest of the things. Here goes in the onions. There are dogs barking in the background. You can also fry the onions that enhances the taste, but I am not frying them. so we are adding the ginger and garlic and here is the coriander green chilies i am using very little and in goes the bread crumbs bread crumbs help in binding and then is the salt to taste red chili powder and cumin powder so we mix this all together i always advise uh, that you wear gloves and do it and if you're not wearing gloves make sure your hands are very clean because i like to uh, bring the mixture together uh, with hands which i'm going to do right now like this so the batter is like looks like this now and now we're going to shape them into uh, the tikkis so wet your hands a little that makes it easier so take portions of batter like this roll them into a bowl and then flatten them like this and make perfect round shapes you can flatten them on a 
wooden board or some surface like this so we make tikis like this ready to go into the fry pan now these are done shape them into these kebabs in fact they are rightfully called kebabs the oil has been heated in the pan we are going to place them in the pan they are going to be shallow fried dough till they are brown we are turning them now they are nicely browned be very careful because it's hot so they are perfectly brown now and we'll switch off the gas and take them out in the plate yeah tada our black chickpea tikis are ready and you can even call them chana kebabs not archna chana kebabs do try them and comment below the video how they turned out to be they are super healthy super yum i've already tasted you can uh, serve them with mint chutney or tomato ketchup or mayo they're really good so i'm sure you'll really like them and uh, subscribe to my channel for more healthy recipes or you'll miss out on them and i can't wait to eat these so i'm going to eat and you try bye